Samsung is gearing up for its next big launch, the Galaxy S26 series, and one of the most exciting rumors so far is about the camera system. With Apple recently introducing its iPhone 17 series and the powerful Pro's video recording feature, Samsung isn't staying behind. Instead, the company seems ready to push video according to the next level with its own technology called the Advanced Professional Video Codec, or APV for short. This could make the Galaxy S26 lineup a serious competitor for creators who care about professional-level video, according Dotso. What exactly is a PV, and why is it being called Samsung's answer to Apple's pros? Let's break it down. A PV was first announced back in 2023, and earlier this year Google integrated it into Android 16. Now, according to leaks, the Galaxy S26 series will be the very first smartphone lineup to officially support it. Just like Proors, APV gives creators more control over how their videos are recorded, edited, and exported. But the interesting part is that APV may actually be more efficient than Apple's codec, which is a bold claim. The biggest highlight is storage efficiency. APV reportedly delivers around 20% more efficiency compared to existing professional codecs, such as HEVC and even Proors. In simple words, you can record higher quality videos with richer detail, wider dynamic range, and more accurate colors while using less storage space. For creators who record long videos or work in 4K and 8K formats, this could be a game changer because storage is always a concern, but efficiency is just one part of the story. APV also supports advanced features like 12-bit color depth, HDR, and log recording. Now, why does that matter? A 12-bit color depth means smoother gradients and fewer issues like banding, which often shows up as weird lines in skies or backgrounds. HDR support, including HDR10 and HDR10+, means your videos will capture a much wider range between dark and bright areas, resulting in more lifelike footage. On top of that, the codec supports for 2 for 2 for chroma subsampling, which ensures color accuracy even in challenging lighting conditions for creators who like to edit their footage. LOG recording is another important addition. Log allows you to capture video in a flat color profile, which might not look great out of the camera, but gives you maximum flexibility when you color grade the footage later. Samsung is also planning to make things easier for people who want quick results. The company will reportedly include built-in LUTs. These are preset color grading filters inside the gallery and studio apps. That means you could export polished, cinematic-looking videos directly from your phone without even touching a computer. Another exciting detail is that APV has been standardized by the Internet Engineering Task Force that gives it a solid foundation for future use and ensures compatibility across devices. It's not just about flat videos either. APV also supports stereoscopic 3D recording. This means Galaxy S26 phones could capture 3D videos that you'd be able to watch on Samsung's upcoming XR headset further expanding into immersive content creation. In terms of flexibility, APV will reportedly cover a wide range of resolutions and frame rates. For example, full HD can be recorded at 25, 50, or even 100 frames per second. 4K has the same frame rate options, including a super smooth 100Fs mode. And yes, 8K video recording will still be there, although capped at to 5Fs. This makes the Galaxy S26 series a versatile tool for both casual users and professionals who want options for different shooting styles. The camera upgrades don't stop with just APV. Samsung is also rumored to introduce Horizon Lock, a feature we've seen on action cameras like the GoPro Hero 11. This feature keeps your video level and stable even if the phone itself is tilted or rotated, which means action shots will look much smoother. Motion photos are also getting an upgrade. With the S26 series, you'll reportedly be able to customize pre-shutter and post-shutter recording, adjust the shutter sound, and control the timing. On top of that, Samsung is adding multi-page document scanning, which will make scanning notes or files far more convenient than the current one-page-at-a-time method. All of this paints a clear picture. Samsung is getting very serious about making the Galaxy S26 series a true filmmaker's phone. While the iPhone 17 Pro's Pro's is already popular among professionals, Samsung's APV codec could attract creators who want high efficiency, strong color accuracy, and advanced editing flexibility straight from their smartphone. In short, the Galaxy S26 camera system could be one of the biggest reasons people upgrade. With features like APV codec, HDR10+, 12-bit color, 
LOG recording, horizon lock, and improved motion photos. Samsung seems to be packing in tools that were once only possible with dedicated professional cameras. And if the rumors are true, this could set a new standard for mobile filmmaking. The competition between Apple and Samsung has always been intense, but this time, Samsung may finally have something that not only matches Apple's pros, but even surpasses it in efficiency and flexibility. The real question is, will this push more creators to choose a Galaxy phone over an iPhone for serious video work? That's something we'll find out once the Galaxy S26 officially launches in 2026.